Hi folks, co-tutor here and my name is Anil Deshpande. Now there is another thing that you need to be aware when it comes to inheritance with interfaces that is how to resolve the interface method calls if there is a multiple inheritance involved. So what do I mean by that? Let's assume that there is an interface A with method foo and then we have interface B and interface C both of which extend interface A and then there is another interface called D which extends both interface B and C. This is quite possible because an interface can extend multiple interfaces or for that matter a class can implement multiple interfaces. So in that case when a method foo gets called which is it actually getting called? Is it from interface C or interface B? So this is basically a kind of conflict and we have to resolve it. So let me create a new package here and then create some classes to demonstrate that multiple inheritance demo dot kt. So here what I will do is I will create a interface A and this will have a function called foo and then I will have uh, another interface b which extends a and which overrides the function foo and let me print b here and let me declare uh, another interface c which extends a again and it also provides me with the implementation of foo but here I am going to just print C. Now let me create a class or it could be for that matter interface as well D which extends B and C. And now I have to give the implementation of the foo method. So when I override the foo method you can see that it automatically suggests that if at all you want to trace back the implementation of foo from interface B then you need to explicitly mention it like this that is super anchor bracket B and then dot foo and then probably after that you want to uh, probably give your own implementation where in this case we will just print say D and now let me implement a main function here and now here well variable and let me initialize it with D and then variable dot foo you will see that it will print B and this is how when you want to resolve which interfaces functionality that you want to inherit. So you can see here that it is B and D and however if I make it C here but what if you want to inherit the implementation of both the interfaces that is both B and C. So that can also be done that is super B. So let me run this you can see that now we are seeing B, C and D. So that's it about the interfaces. In the next video we will just continue to explore. So stay tuned. That brings us to the end of this particular video. Don't forget to like, comment, share the video and subscribe to the channel. Take care. Bye.